Hello folks, hello, it's Nana JL54 and it's time for a tutorial. I hope you guys can see this, okay? As uh, so I'm working on uh, grandma's things. So I'm gonna show you the brooches that I'm making and these, they're in parts. So what I, I don't have the original uh, setup, so, well, kind of, I can, hold on. Okay. I started out with this blank chipboard and this is my road chipboard and so what I did was I painted them first I gessoed them and then I painted them with uh, I mixed white and a like a buttercream color together and then I uh, embossed them with a script stamp uh, a Fisker script stamp with uh, gold embossing powder so a little script going on there and so and then the bases which are these the, this part here is done with um, ultra thick embossing powder and this is done in the bronze. So they started out like this and they ended up looking like this, like this. And then I heat, I did two layers and then I heat the, heated the base up again and then used, glued it. I used it like glue and just pushed these little things down inside. So I made cameos. And then what I'm gonna show you is how I got this effect. I hope you can see it. I don't know, I don't wanna hold it too close. But um, if you can see, it's got like a, a pretty design going on. Here's another one. So I'm gonna show you how I do that really quick. So, all right. So I have a stamp and this is from, um, who is it by seven gypsies this is by seven gypsies and um i don't remember the name of the anyway it's an old seven gypsies part of a seven gypsy stamp set and um so what i what i've done is i've inked it up with embossing um ink so that you know it doesn't stick you know i mean it really doesn't stick but i just just in case it's just a kind of for sorta so what i'm going to do is i'm going to heat this up I'm going to impress this in there and we're going to get something like this. Okay, let me use a bigger one. This one. All right. So we're going to use this one. All right. So it starts out like this. And excuse me, I'm going to have to get in front of the camera here. Okay. So I'm going to, oh, well, this one slid over. Hold on. See, it came unglued because it wasn't pushed in tight. So we'll just fix that. Can you, I'm sorry. Like this is gonna be fun. Trying to you gotta liquefy it again. Okay, and I'm gonna set this down in there without burning myself and push it down in there. Alright. I'm gonna heat it up a little more around it so I can uh oh, what happened here? This is what not to do. You've heard of what not to wear, this is what not to do. Okay, when you see it starting to move around, then is the time to stick it in. Okay, I'm gonna stick it in. All right, I'm gonna push it down there. I'm gonna hold it. Sorry my hands are in the way, but you know, what can I say? If you let off too soon, it'll pop back out. I'm sorry if I'm yelling, I haven't done, with this little camera, I haven't done something in a while. Okay, there. So now I have to figure out what part of the stamp that I want, what part of the swirl, and I think what I want is this. Okay, all right, so I know what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna heat this back up. And liquefy it, and then I'm going to set that down in there. I'm gonna hold it down. It doesn't take long and then I'm gonna pull it up see I have it embossed it's embossed so we're gonna do this one here and I think I'm gonna use this part here this part here okay so I'm gonna heat this up let me see if I can fix this for you guys I can't get any closer I'm sorry um, let me Okay, I hope that's not blurry, but we're gonna go for it. I 
talk amongst yourselves. And I have to do a hundred of these. So, oops, there we are. So hopefully you could see that. All right, so that's what I'm doing and I gotta go. No, I don't have to go and let's do another one. All right, I have time to do another one. Okay, so we're gonna do another one. Let's do this one. I'm sorry, my hand is in the way. I have to get a boom. Um, I looked up booms on the internet. Um, yeah, I have to look it up under some other name. If anybody has a suggestion where I can get a boom, um, what to call it when I look it up, um, I would be mighty appreciative and that would be mighty fine. Um, now this, I kind of want, I don't know what I want here. I've, I have to position it to see what I want. Mm, I think I want that. Okay, all right. Ah, is that what I want? Maybe, we'll see. The beauty about this is you can, you don't want to do it too much, but if you mess up, you can heat it and it'll all melt back again. That looks all right. Where's my spatula? my spatular that looks okay all right because it's going to be on another base all right i'm going to stop and bring back the base that i'm going to put it on i'll be right back okay i'm back and so i brought um one of the doilies with the seam binding in it and what's going to happen is they're going to be like this they're going to be like this there's going to be a stick pin these are going to be hot glued on and there's going to be a stick pin to hold it on the ladies' dresses. So I hope you like that. I hope you could see it and um, um, make you some. They're really fun to make. Um, if you don't have the, you can just, if you don't have the chipboard, you can get these things and stick them in a flower or something. I just, I love these cameo things. And um, yeah, I'm making a hundred. <laughs> so um, talk to you guys later. Have a good Sunday. I talked to the little um, the little mystery guests today, and they're having fun. They got their American Girl uh, dolls ears pierced yesterday, so they're changing earrings as we speak. So um, missing them, but I'm glad they're having fun. Love you guys. Talk to you later. Bye.